So, um, I did something for Halloween. <laughs> So if you are a subscriber of my channel and you've been long watching my content, you might be wondering, girl, where the fuck have you been? You know, just living my life. If everything goes well, this is October 1 and I posted so uh, I decided to do the impossible task of not only making my own costumes but having a legitimate photo shoot for them and then making sure I upload it on October 1. Let's get on with the video. Hope you enjoy. Bye. Alright, so welcome to week one and this week I'm sort of making a skeleton queen and honestly I don't know what the fuck I am but I am wearing gold bibs and a skull crown so use your imagination. So I'll narrate this pretending that you're actually gonna do this at some point and if you do, oh my god, tag me on Instagram at Bell. Shameless promo. First things first, the ribs. Shay's gonna make a bodice of me. For this, you're gonna need a friend. Or you could ask your mom or your dog if they're helpful. But whatever they are, they are gonna help you make a bodice. You could use cling wrap or a trash bag like us because I'm broke trash. You could use packing tape, but I recommend duct tape as it holds its shape better. I'll get more views because I'm in a bra. Wrap the tape around your body. You could use Shay's technique where you cut the tape into strips to better fit the natural curvatures. And um, oh wait, I forgot to introduce you to my roommates. <laughs> Shout out to my roommates especially Ninya and Shay. After successfully taping and cutting, be careful. It's scary. How are you doing? Fine. Yay! We have our bodice. Next steps are super fun. You'll need a shit ton of glue stick. Like, I mean, a shit ton, like a lot. First, you sketch out your rib shape. Now, I first contemplated if I should count or actually, you know, make the ribs realistic, but nah, where's the fun in that? So, make them as fantastically full as you can and glue away. Like, seriously, don't underestimate how much glue sticks you'll need. If you think you have enough, go and grab some more, like a lot more, and enjoy this time lapse as there's a lot of time lapse coming, so. This is what you clicked on. Please keep watching. When you're finally done with that, spray paint it gold. Simple. Now for the crown, I was just winging it because honestly, if you're observant, you can see that these are the same skulls that were in my intro. The whole head or the whole skull would not fit onto the crown, like attach nearly as well as what I did, which was melting half of it off. So it's easier to attach. I attached it to these thorn-like shapes that are made from zip ties. Now I know what you're thinking. What the fuck are you gonna wear? Well, you see, I'm a lucky girl. I live in a dorm meant for six people. That's not the lucky part. Why? Because it's cheap. And last semester, I was lucky to only have one roommate. That's Freya over there. 
What? You <laughs> And I'm really thankful for her. Not only for being my roommate, but listening to my sob stories, being my friend, a storyteller as she is an aspiring nurse and she has a lot of really fun stories that she gets to go home and tell me about them. <laughs> And she takes good care of me too when I'm sick, so. But yeah, she provided me with two dresses, which is so helpful. And um, ah, thank you for you. <laughs> Not just for the dresses, but for everything we've been through so far. Comment down below, thank you for you, if you want for you in your life. Now before the dress rehearsal, because we're almost done, yay. Let's talk about fails, because I am not ashamed to share them with you. Because after all, I am human and I make mistakes. Mistake number one was the dress. I was gonna make a ball gown dress using trash bags. That was supposed to be- but it did not work. I swear to god, it did not work. I made attached trash bags because in my brain I thought, oh, it would give it so much volume. But what I didn't think about was the length of not only the trash bags, but also the length of the dress. Because I thought that the dress would go over the trash bags, so it'll just look like this really puffy gown. It's fun. It just looks weird. And I, I, I don't mean the pajamas. Ow, 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 it's stuck to my earring. Ow, it's stuck to my, oh my God. Oh my God, I am so, I am in so much pain. Help me, help me please, help me please. Moving on. Oh, finally. Time to shoot. Not myself. Like, photo shoot. I'm sure you get it. I'm just the one who has problems. Photo shoot day. Of course, of course, I have to thank my friends, Leanne and Andre, for helping me so much. Like, this would not have happened without them. Leanne as my photographer and Andre for so many things. Oh my god, bless his heart. Thank you guys so much. Lian is such a talented photographer and I can't wait to see her strive. And Andre is talented in so many different things. He's very flexible. Not only did he help Lian with like reflectors and like taking good shots, he also helped me yeah. with little oh things God. and also big things like editing my pictures. Thank you so much, Andre. Ah, thank you guys. Without further ado, here are the results. Shaking hands or hugging, kiss on a cheek or loving, just like we. Our names get lost in history